If I take your career away, if I take your degree away, what's your purpose? They then go on to say that your purpose as a woman is to have children, and if you haven't done that, you failed. Women's purpose is not to be baby-making machines, and I'm so sick of people trying to reduce us to our ability to procreate. So that idea is stupid and really needs to die. I'm not saying that women who have children haven't done something that's a beautiful and amazing and great thing, because it is beautiful and amazing and great, but it's definitely not the end-all, be-all of accomplishments, and you're not a failure if you haven't done that. I knew that I never wanted to have kids ever since I was a kid myself, and I'm 31 and I still haven't changed my mind, and I don't think that's ever going to change. But anyway, to answer the question, I feel like my purpose is to leave the world a little bit less awful than it was when I entered it, and I could still do that, even if I didn't have my career, if I didn't have my education, if I wasn't a doctor, I could still do that, but being a physician enables me to do it in the way that I want to do it. That's what my purpose is. I'm so sick of men who try to downplay women's achievements and our accomplishments. It takes a lot of grit, it takes a lot of determination, it takes a lot of discipline to be able to achieve these things, especially in a society that's extremely racist and misogynistic. So as a minority woman, you're damn right I'm going to be proud of these things that I have accomplished, and there's nothing wrong with that. I think what the real issue is is that a lot of these men are barely able to take care of themselves, and they haven't accomplished the same things that the women that they're looking at have accomplished. So instead of like being proud of the fact that you've be, been able to persevere and achieve these things, they'll try to tear you down and downplay your accomplishments. Any guy that acts like that, you already know he's insecure and you probably don't want to deal with him. A better question is, what do you think your purpose is as a man? And I don't want to hear any Bible quotes because I'm not religious and not everybody's religious.